Backing up only a week after Twickenham, Australia made two changes for Lansdowne Road. Matt Burke replaced the injured Moon and Chris Roach came in for David Cody. The Irish selectors named five new caps including the flying centre Brendan Mullen and halfback Michael Bradley. The selectors deliberated for seven and a half hours and the recall of hooker Kieran Fitzgerald to lead the side proved a masterstroke. Mark Eller, who had that scintillating game for Australia in the first international. Rodriguez does well. Ireland, though, in front of the kicker. And this certainly is a very dangerous position for the Irish. Leading by 6-3 to three at the moment. All of those losses, though, for the Irish have been here at Lansdowne Road. Now, there's a chance here for a drop goal for Michael Liner. He struck it well. It's a beauty. Michael Lyon would be very pleased with that effort from approximately 40 metres out. It certainly was a lovely pot by the youngster. Vital scrum for Australia. Mark Eller. Back to Liner. Now it's Gould. Two on two. Roger Gould lost it forward. Linehan. And Anderson. Cutler took it well. Good ball for Australia. Far Jones sniping. Still going. Eller. Mark Eller. What's he going to do? He's standing up at the tackle. Williams. Australia right on the goal line. Where's the ball? Ireland come away. What a let off. Five metre scrum. And Chris Roach. Uh, it's hard to see what the injury is. Uh, he's pointing to his ribs. Although a player down, Australia continued the pressure but bombed a certain try. From the Royal Ulster Constabulary. Well won at the front. Campisi, straight through. Look at him go. Ployevin, Matthew Burke's outside. Test match delicately poised. Australia ahead by three points to nil. Williams took it. He's been dispossessed. Ireland have lost it forward. Bradley again the offender. Now Australia can clear it. Far Jones. He's a tiger. Point of in there. Far Jones again. Liner. Ella. Cut out to Gould. Look at the overlap. Burke. Campisi. Goose step. Did he? Burke again. Solid defence from Ireland. That's the possession Australia wanted, but they were a bit slow there. Here it comes. Far Jones. Mark Eller. Field goal. It's a good one. Oh, lovely pop there by Mark Eller. The second field goal of the match. Liner with a torpedo kick straight to McNeil. He was in perfect position. He's a great runner, this man. Heinemann the tackler, Sexton in there for Ireland, good ball for the Irish, Bradley, no high tackle, it was around the shoulders, but uh, the crowd calling for a high tackle, here's our friend Mr Norling, it's gone through, off the uprights, three points in it, Ireland right back in the match. Rodriguez got it back to Far Jones. Oh, there's a big drive from the Irish forwards. Now they can run it. Mullen. Here comes McNeil. Overlap for England. Mark Eller. He can't take him. Finn. Kick charged down by Gould. But brilliant attacking sortie there from the Irish. Norling has his flag out again. Another penalty to Ireland. It's pretty well an identical spot. He's got it. Lansdowne Road has a ruptured. Ireland six, Australia six. Anderson won it. Back to McCoy. Now it's Sexton.
Good play there from McCoy. He still has it. They're going to run it here. McNeil. Keenan's outside. Finn. Australia in trouble. Campisi there. Offside play there. Obstruction, it appears. Silly mistake by the Australians. Keenan now to give Ireland the lead. Here's Mark Eller. Field goal attempt. It's a good one. Scores a level. Second field goal for Mark Eller. That gives Australia great heart. The backs have met stern opposition today from the Irish. Cutler, brilliantly won. Eller. Mark Eller takes it up. Line up. Oh, man taken out of the play. Matthew Burke. Campisi. Campisi. Mark Eller. What a try. Superb try from the Australians. All from Mark Eller's work, taking it right up to the Irish defence and putting Michael Liner through a lovely gap. Mark Eller scores his third try in Test match.